Hola book nerds, I'm here with my unboxing. And when I say unboxing, I mean literally no unboxing because I opened them all. This is the this is the edition where I actually opened up pretty much all of these packages. I don't even know how I ended up getting so many. Uh yeah, let's get started. So the first thing I have to show you is this little giveaway thing that I won from Jean Book Nerd. And I won this necklace and it has like a colored sand. It doesn't really match what I'm wearing right now, but it's really cute. Um, I think it's from a mermaid book. I don't want to say, I don't even know which book it was, but it was so long ago. And there was this, um, I don't know, it says, there's a ribbon here and it says below. I don't actually know what that means. And here is her button for her site. And I won this book, which is funny because I kind of have it already, but this one's signed. So um, I'm going to give away the other one by uh, J. Kristoff. And this is a signed bookmark. I love his books. You can see all of the covers from his editions there. And she also sent me this cute little card because she is the sweetest. Thank you so much, Jean. This package from Better World Books. And I have to tell you a little story about this because I found it from Amazon Marketplace and it was for one cent. And I basically paid like six bucks for shipping. Um, I knew I wasn't going to get such a great edition, but whatever. The book is still readable. It's just, this book is out of print and it's really hard to find anywhere. I don't know if I will just keep it because it is, it clearly is water damaged. Um, it's like yellow. There's this ripped corner here, but other than the fact it's still readable. Um, and what can you get for one cent? This is Magic Study by Maria V. Snyder. I really want to find a copy of this. But I also want to find an affordable copy because people are selling it for crazy expensive prices. This package here is from uh, Random House. It has their Random House logo. And I sneaked a peek at this one. You can't blame me. I just... When you get a package, you're just like, I want to know what's in it or it will haunt me. This is Shadow Scale by Rachel Hartman. And I have an arc of this, which is signed, so I'm definitely keeping it. This is the finished copy and it's just so, so pretty. <sighs> the only thing is my copy of um, Serafina is in paperback, so I don't know. Maybe I'll just find, oh, my hair. Maybe I'll just find a hardcover of Serafina. And this one is already out, I believe. So March 10th. Thank you so much. Double Day Canada, I believe it is. Double Day, yes. And other than that one cent book, I bought these books from Indigo. I got books that I've already read, and this is Endless by Jessica Shervington. Love this series. Angels, Angel Badasses for the Win. And then I got Hourglass by Myra McIntyre. McIntyre. I already read this one and I enjoyed it. It is one of the Edgement titles and because Edgement USA are closing its doors, I decided to get it before it gets out of stock. So um, my collection is now complete. And then I went to Value Village and there was all of these amazing used books there. I was looking and looking and I found these two books. This is Wallbanger by Alice Clayton. It's not in, it's not like perfect condition, but it's still in rather amazing condition. It was about $4.99, so I'm really uh, glad. This was $18.99, like full price. I found this copy of Last Sacrifice. Um, I know I don't have this book because in my Goodreads, it is marked as borrowed. So yay, my edition is this one. I've been collecting these kind of copies. I know the other ones don't come in hardcover, which is really weird, Penguin. I don't even know what they were thinking because this is probably one of the most popular series. I don't like the new ones, so I decided to get this one. Also, $4.99. What can you do? It is a hardcover. Here is one copy. I think it's from Random House. I will see. Yeah, oh, it's Penguin Random House now. 
their label has changed and it is Little Red Lies by Julie Johnston. I don't know much about this one. Um, I think I actually have another copy on my shelf, but it this is in paperback, so I might have to give this one away. This one is from Random House as well. Is it Random House, I think? I think so, Random House. And it is Everything, Everything by Nicola Yoon. I actually seen this around on Goodreads. I don't know much about it. It just looks like it's a contemporary. And it is. It says, my disease is as rare as it is. My disease is as rare as it is famous. She's basically allergic to the world. Um, This sounds like a good book because I really like those... Um, I know they're calling it cichlid. Um This sounds really cute. Thank you so much, Lindsay. She wrote a letter and I like the cover. It's pretty and it's so. This is another package from Random House. I get a lot of mail from them. Um, this is exciting. This is Kelly Armstrong's Empire of Night. I actually started reading Sea of Shadows, but I'm glad to know that this copy is already here. So yay for no waiting for the next book. Um, this is coming out, I believe, April 11th? Oh, April 7th? Uh, yeah. It looks fun. Um, I read her other series. I forget what it's called. Um, the ones that, it's like the Calling series, I don't know what it's called, I read it so long ago, but um, yeah, it says, the legends are true, the shadow is real, that is a pretty amazing cover. This one is from Simon and Schuster Canada, um, this is an arc I've actually have never seen before, so I'm excited, this is Incarnations by Susan Barker, I believe it is an Asian folklore retelling. That's all I'm getting from the back here and it's coming out When is it coming out? Doesn't actually say here um, Usually have it at the side it says There is no for sale date That's weird, but anyway, it sounds really interesting um, I believe this is uh, YA don't quote me on that though. Another package from Penguin Random House. This is Catch You Later Trader by e Abby. Abby? I don't actually know the author's. Oops. Yeah, by Abby. Oh, someone who has one name. And this one is already out. It looks like it's a middle grade read. I am a super fan of this next book. Can you guys guess? I like how it's wrapped in the paper. This is Sophie Kinsella's new book, uh, Finding Audrey. Read it and loved it. I gave it a four to five. It is about a girl who has major uh, social anxiety. So she's trying to open herself up more. Her family is very, very supportive. And I thought it was really funny. The family is just hilarious. It has Sophie's wit and style, but it's also a little darker because of the whole um, aspect. Um, my review will be up before the on-sale date, which is June 13th. So I already read this a long time ago. This next book is from K Publicity, and they reached out to me to review Catalyst by Lydia Kang. I already loved it. Um, my review was just up yesterday. It is a science fiction novel about gene mutations in people and how they survive and all that good stuff. So I loved it and I believe this one's already out. Yeah. The next book here is from Macmillan because the author saw my status on his book in Goodreads and I was like, I'm going to read this on Wattpad. I will download it. But he reached out to me and he sent me a copy. This is The Novice by Taran Mathuru. Mathuru? Um, it just looks so fantasy filled and I'm so excited. I already read a bit of it and it is coming out... May. Um, I don't know what day though. Just says May 2015. 
Plus, but not least, is this package is from Penguin Random House. And I think I dropped something. Oops. This is a Black Dove White Raven by Elizabeth Wine. Wayne. Wine. Oh, God. I always butcher her last name. Um, I read uh, her other book, Codename Verity, and really enjoyed it. This is the UK cover, I think. Um, it's already out, and I'm surprised I haven't even read this yet. This is... Oh, no, it's not out. It's out soon. It's March 31st. It'll be out. So, I'm so excited. Thank you so much to all the publishers, Macmillan, Simon & Schuster Canada, Penguin Random House, and if I missed anyone, any other publishers, Cable Felicity. Oh, so many awesomeness. So many books. Such a little time. Until next time, bye book nerds.